The culture of North America changed forever in the year 1513. In April, the Spanish explorer Juan Ponce de Leon landed while searching for the fabled Isle of Bimini. The exact landing spot where Ponce and his men came ashore remains unknown, but it was apparently somewhere between the Cape Canaveral area and the mouth of the St. John's River. Searching for this historic site, archaeologists have conducted numerous digs at the Fountain of Youth, a national archaeological park where a Tamukian Indian called Saloy was located and where the city of St. Augustine had its beginning. Ponce de Leon was on a mission of exploration, not settlement, and his visit to northeast Florida was brief. Because he arrived during the Easter season, known as the Pasqua Florida, Ponce named his new discovery La Florida, a name still used today. Besides naming the land and claiming it for Spain, Ponce de Leon made a discovery that was to lead to the creation of St. Augustine. Sailing along the Florida coastline, Ponce de Leon realized that a strong current was carrying his ships rapidly northward. This would aid in quickly returning Spanish ships home and was later called the Gulf Stream. Although Timaquans may not have made much contact with the Spanish after Ponce de Leon sailed away, Native Americans in other parts of Florida welcomed, battled with, and fled from numerous Spanish expeditions. Ponce then turned his attention to the west coast of Florida, where he died from a poisoned arrow.